Hi, I'm Scott. And I'm Grace. And, and this, this is, is the Offbeat, offbeat podcast. podcast. We're bringing the party out of the studio, getting a little offbeat, and everyone's invited. Right along with us as we get down and dirty with the Inspire community. Don't forget to rate, review, share, and subscribe. Hello. Hello. <laughs> we are Welcome back, back again. Hi, Scotty. Hi, Hi Grace. You? Thank How's you so your week? much. Oh, look, it's been busy, it's been hectic trying to get ready for Christmas and. Yeah. All that sort of gaff yeah. and the usual day-to-day life. Very exciting. Um, thanks, guys, for joining us again for Off Beat, the podcast, the Inspire podcast. Yes. Um, today, special guests joining us. I know we've got from the two Rumble of Room. The Rumble Room greats. Ding, Woo-hoo-hoo. ding, ding. Woo-hoo. Alex and Casey. Hello. Hey guys. Yes. How are you going? How are you feeling? So good. How are you? Keen? Good, yeah. Good, yeah. good, good. Yeah, Thanks yeah, so yeah. much for coming in. That's all right. Um, Thanks for having us. <laughs> yeah, so I guess we wanted to get you guys in for a chat today. Mm-hmm. So obviously, find out a bit more about you guys. Find out a bit more about what happens in the Rumble Room. It is obviously the the newer addition to the Inspire yeah. offering. So it's, it's very amazing right. how many people yeah. don't yeah. know love about it. it. Yeah. <laughs> Do love the Rumble Room. Now, obviously, both of you guys have a bit of a history in boxing. I guess, Casey, how did you sort of get into boxing initially? What, what was the story there? What's your background? It was kind of like a backyard thing, to be honest. Like me and my brothers used to just, I don't know, like, Play fight. Yeah, play fight, hit yeah. it, like, you know, <laughs> rumble each other up. And, like, so I guess I learned a few, like, tips and tricks there. And then, you yeah, know, the, the day we bought a uh, boxing bag on Christmas, you know, and then that's when Aww. that's yeah. when, that's when it started, you know. So, Cute. you know, but I didn't use the bag. I used my brothers. So. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> well, they use you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I was the punching bag. So. Yeah. Because <laughs> I was the youngest boy. So, you know. Now, you, you say youngest boy. Can we not skip over? How many brothers and sisters <laughs> yeah. do you oh, have, Alec? God. Um, well... <laughs> He's like, oh, he doesn't even know. He's like, I don't know. Like, my mum had nine, and then on the step side of my family, there's four. That is So there's 13 actually all up. So there's 13. Sorry, miss. Yeah, there's a miss. uh, miss, mismatch there. There's there's 13 of us, but there's nine that uh, that are blood related. And your youngest? I'm in the middle. So the youngest is now two. Freshie. And the oldest is 27. And the oldest is 27. So it's a big family. Massive. Yeah, when we all King. sit on the couch, I'm looking at them like, wow. Hi, guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Do all of you sit on the couch? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's it's so like good. some sort of so Von many friends. Trapp musical style oh, family. Oh, yeah, that's cute. Yeah. That could be a Halloween outfit. Yes. The Von Trapp family. Oh. Yes. Come dressed as the Stevensons. The Stevensons. You and 27 <laughs> friends. Nice. You and your 27 friends. <laughs> <laughs> and that. what else? Like, what got you into fitness case? Um, on Oh, my brothers. They, um... When I was like, I was like 10 years old and I looked outside my backyard and I see my brothers all working out and I'm in my room. I used to be the kid that eats shapes. I, I used to eat shapes and that. So like, they Nothing. kind of- I love shapes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, but, what are you doing to shapes? No, but honestly, I was just like, I was just so unmotivated at that age, even yeah. though like at that age, you're still figuring out what you're doing. But, um, you know, my brothers, I see them like doing push ups and that. And I was like, yeah, I want to do that. So it was honestly my brothers that got me into it. Aww. Um, yeah. And then like when I did it, and then when I started doing it, I started like doing like I started like doing push ups every night before bed. Oh. So I used that I used that as like a as like I was like a challenge, you know. So I used to do like twenty push ups every night and then it like led into thirty, then forty, fifty. Yeah. And then it just became a routine. It's At your ten? Like, oh yeah, like 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Wow, you know? So amazing. it's like yeah. Over the years it's, it's a like, humble brag of how many push ups yeah. you can do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I get what's happening here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna beat it last night. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you know, so it's over like a period a of time, yeah, 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 you know, and it, and it honestly, like, dr- it drove me to be honest, mm. yeah, to become better, and yeah, and like even to this day, I do skip days, but you know, like, I like Who the other night, the other night, literally, I did push-ups, you know? eat shapes, you know, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and I still eat shapes, you know. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's all about balance, guys, you know? Yeah, but, I love yeah. that. So, yeah, so it was a consistent thing. Same yeah. with you. What about you, Alex? Got me into boxing, fitness. Boxing. Fitness. What's well, I've got like eight years of it, eight years of experience, I guess, in the fitness world. Yeah. But boxing itself, I only really did one-on-one, like just with PTs. So. Yeah. Never really was a boxer because I don't, like, I'm not very angry, I feel. Like, I don't feel like you have to be that angry to be a boxer. <laughs> However, I started doing a bit of it and I love it. Like, I just yeah. love that feeling of empowerment after it. You know, like once you hit that bag, you just like, you find something and you're yeah. like, oh shit. Mm. Like there's something within me I needed to let out. And yeah. I think that's such an good important release. part. Mm. Yeah, totally. So I think that when it came to boxing, that was my thing. It was like a good stress release really, to be honest. Yeah. And then the rumble room's just been incredible. Something like when you're in a big dark room and you can hit something, it's just mm. like, holy shit. Good that's mix amazing. of like boxing and 
Stress release. Stress. Yes. Mm. And F45, which is your yes. other background. Yes, that's my background. Burpee and I do love a burpee. Love plyo, or two. Which can't I can't help hate. myself. I just can't help myself. It's part of me. It's just ingrained in me the now. Queen. Yeah, the yeah. queen of that. You're really taking it on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> totally. Nah. It's so much. It's better than F45. Sorry, F45. What did you do before F45? PT. Was it was like one on one. Yeah. Like ran my own business out of a gym, which was interesting, yeah. if I'm saying the least, because mm-hmm. it is, yeah, you're working for tough. someone else, but you're basically running your own business. It's really, really tough. Yeah. Um, but I loved it at the same time, a lot of experience. And I think it's something everyone should do in the PT world before you get into group fitness and that sort of thing. But yeah. Did you do that, Scotty? Oh, PTs. way back in the day. Yeah. Yeah. It's not something I'd probably go back to. <laughs> yeah, probably not. <laughs> yeah. I think I You're like I don't know if I entertaining the, the crowd. Yeah, more I, than prefer, the I prefer fitness. the crowd work. Yeah. <laughs> true, true. I do love the one on one, so I love engaging and getting to know yeah. people and helping them, like, and you, can, you know. Yeah, like it's real technical when you go one on one. Totally. You know? Like totally. 18 people in a bag, it's hard to, like, go, like, you know, get around to all the 18 people in the space yeah. of, like, like how many clients do you have now, Case, with one on ones? Um, oh. Few. But yeah, really, like 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 at the moment, it's still fresh. There's like six, six or seven. That's great. Um, but I think it's that's like, amazing. Yeah, but like I want to keep. Yeah, I'd say like, I guess I'll keep building it. But but uh, but yeah, it's a little 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 side thing. Even so. to give six or seven people attention is amazing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh great. yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I love like even even at Inspire, you know, I love to like you yeah. know like really grab people one on one outside the class and, and you know be like yeah, oh, have a know, chat. Consistency is key, you know. Like yeah. And, yeah, just have a chat. Tell them what to work on. You know, have that connection with them. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah, yeah. And I think I, I mean obviously I said boxing. At Inspire is a very fairly new offering, so I guess to anyone that hasn't tried it before, yeah. what what sort of sets Inspire's boxing program apart from other programs you've taught in the past, guys? Having that card to inspire, you know, like to inspire people mm-hmm. to let out something towards the end. I think like in other inspire classes, round. yeah, Inspire Round. Yeah. And I, I, you know, I've never come across a place like that. You know, where you get to say whatever slash inspire people yeah you know, and you're like yeah. okay because that was me like i used to say that around my family and my sister was like oh shut up you know yeah but i'm like yeah. oh where do i say this where do now. i say this yeah. and i get to say it here you know so yeah. i think that's uh, totally. that's special to me you know i think it's just something special about that rumble room to be honest like i've worked in gyms i've worked in group fitness i've done all that kind of stuff but to be able to come into a room where the, it's like the lights are down the Dark. music's loud you literally feel like you're in a it's night even club. darker than the cycle room literally like it's black it is in there black. if you're in the back corner you could lie down and nobody cares just come for the music Oh, that's what Holly does. Just have a vibe in the back. Yeah, yeah. I, see, I, see Holly, I see Holly lying down there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We've all been it's there. It's so good. But yeah, it's just it's amazing. Like, and just letting something out. Like, you don't realise how much you actually need. Like, you hold on to. You know what yeah. I mean? Mm. You come in and do a session and you're just like, holy shit. And as a new mm. trainer, like, for me to see people do you that, see you just see it. And you see their confidence. You see them just, like, yeah. building each yeah. time they step through that door. And it's yeah. just incredible. Yeah, like, people who come in nervous at first yeah. come out of the 10th class, like, Blowing up, yeah, you know, they're mm-hmm. like, absolutely. You know, it's it's great to see, and yeah. even just like in the class coming in, you know, they might be having a pretty shitty day or yeah, you know, oh, yeah. something's going on. And then they come out and they, you can just tell yeah. that they're yeah. just like, oh, okay, they've let it go, yeah, yeah. you know, and then they're gonna yeah. like get on with their day and they're good, it's good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. I just speak to a lot of people and they sort of say they're, they're still that sort of intimidation because it is a dark room. Yeah, often people For have sure. never boxed and never put on a pair of boxing gloves. Yeah, what advice would you sort of give to someone who's looking to try? The rumble room, but oh, maybe just come a little bit in. nervous. Yeah, just like, do it. Just do it. Like, just Honestly, do it. the second you get through there, yeah. like everything, we tell you everything that you need to do. So there's yeah. really nothing to be worried about or scared about. If you're fully intimidated, go up the back, you know, for your first time. Yeah, totally. I do still. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> just stay up the back, chuck those gloves on and just start hitting the back. We're there to help, obviously, and we're there to like What's guide you through it. What's the class kind of like? I guess kind of they're all a bit different. We're all a bit different in how we train and how we want to. Yeah, different style. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But you do do a bit of like on the bag work. So where you're just hitting that bag and we obviously help you with the technique, make sure you know what you're doing, make sure your form's correct. Yeah. And if it's not, just hit that bag. We're happy. Yeah. yeah. There's no real wrong way to do it. There's like, no, real, no, as long as this big black ball is There's no real wrong way to do it. Yeah. <laughs> and like, and like Alex is. and I, yeah, yeah. And like Alex and I will like, will like pick up on like technique, you know. Yeah. Like we will like correct you, but it's like never take it the wrong way. You know, no, which totally. we're trying to help you you know so it's like and if you don't that's fine like yeah. we're not we're not going to be mad at you yeah, <laughs> as long no, as you come in not, and you no. just give it a go yeah. then we do have y bells that we use and if you're not familiar with them they're so easy to use yeah, aren't yeah, they yeah, yeah. The oh easiest. god they, they got like yeah uh, three different handles to it yeah one handle in the middle can't go so wrong we, yeah, <laughs> yeah we do like a thousand things with it so yeah. Yeah. yeah and then there's obviously we build your strength as well and then we've got a core round so it's epic for yeah. your core yeah. Body, yeah. kind body. of works hand in hand with cycle as well so if you wanted to do like get your core feeling better especially in that cycle room it does work well together yeah yeah 
Yeah. I do love that. And that's probably the good thing about, I guess, the Inspire community as well. We've spoken about a lot in a few episodes prior is that it's that sort of judgment-free zone. So if people are coming in and they are nervous, they're coming into that judgment-free zone. Yeah. And I think people who do spin, who haven't tried boxing, I just think it's the exact same vibe as a cycle, but even 100%. less intimidating, I feel. Oh, for yeah. sure. Because it's so yourself and spin's the same, but you can see everybody. Spin is very much, you're still in the group, yeah. whereas yeah. boxing, you're really by yourself. Yeah. Totally. And yeah. it's all just you. Oh, yeah. And, yeah. And you know what the most common like common question is like asked to me? Like they say, do we fight in there? And I'm like, nah. Really? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like that. Friday Night Fight Club? Oh, People well, that like, makes sense. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> makes sense. It's in like, the name, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is in the name, yeah. But I'm like, nah, <laughs> it's like, to- totally opposite. It's that, like, oh, right. damn, don't want to come now because yeah. yeah. I don't get to fight you. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And <laughs> the same is like, it, do I need to have like a partner to do it with? And it's a solid yes. no, you know, there's that. Yeah. Yeah. It's just you. Yeah. You just need you. And you don't even need to be a certain fitness level or anything like that. Like, no. It's, it's so, so much fun, yeah. oh, isn't it? I love boxing. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. so much fun. Yeah. You're so good at it. Yeah. Oh, thanks, guys. I walk past. Up. Yeah, I walk, I walk past the bag and I hear smack, smack, and I'm like, us, smack, I walk, smack. I walk, us, I walk us. the other day, us, us, you know. <laughs> 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 I'll go. Yeah. Smack, smack, smack. His hustles. Literally. Oh, now, Alex. Now, so you moved up here mm-hmm. from Melbourne. Good old Melbourne, right before so COVID. Everybody's yeah. coming or going from Melbourne. Aren't really they attracting. Ever? Yeah, mm. really. I mean, Mel- I know a lot more coming than going there. I don't. Yeah, yeah. no one's keen to get. I mean, back Georgia into and Dom. Melbourne. Georgia the and Dom. I don't know Losers. why they're doing it. Yeah. What prompted the move up here? What was the driving force behind that? And for how me, did that all go? How did that all happen? Shit. Um, <laughs> for me, that all started from the weather because I yeah. just love yeah. the weather. My nan lives up here, so for like 10 years I've been mo- like coming up, visiting, staying with her, and the weather is just the best. The vibe, the people. Like, I don't know if you've been to Melbourne, but anyway. Uh, <laughs> that's all I'm going to say on that. No, I love Melbourne. Obviously, all my family and friends are still there, but it was just something I've always really wanted to do. So then I sort of said to Will, which is my partner, I really want to do it. Let's go. Yeah. And it took a while, but we got there in the end. Yeah. Mm. And we literally moved February 2020 and then COVID hit 2020. Oh uh, March. Wow. Insane. We were here yeah. for a month and then it was like, okay, good luck seeing your family for the next year. So that was, I guess, really, really tough. hard. Yeah. Really tough. Especially in your first move anywhere. Anywhere. Like you still want that little bit of contact, yeah. like knowing that you're a flight away or whatever. Literally. It was yeah. the easiest thing to be like, it's fine, guys. If anything goes wrong, I'll just see you. Like, I'll drive, uh, I'll fly down two hours. I'm there. And now I'm like, oh my God. Yes. Yeah. And it was just insane. So I guess you for kind me, of escaped like, that, hey? No. Melbourne. Well, you escaped the Melbourne lockdowns. Yeah. I was very lucky. Done well. That extremely way, lucky. But, yeah. but apart from seeing family and stuff, lucky Sucks. FaceTime was there and Zoom. Yeah. All that kind of stuff. Yeah, that's good stuff. But no, exercise in that time, I don't know about you guys, but for me, during COVID, exercise was the biggest thing. I was like, I need this just as like a bit of a stress release. Yeah. yeah. Definitely. Get out of the house. Yeah. yeah. For sure. Now, I don't know if you've listened to the show before, but one of the segments of we like to do is a bit of a quick fire segment. So think of it as a sort of knock would you round. rather knockout round. Ooh. You do both have drinks there. So if you prefer not to answer a question you can uh, for any reason, you can pass by oh, having a drink. I am drink nervous. Yeah. But <laughs> just answer it. Like okay, just has. answer it. Yeah. Great. Um, so we got Casey. Have you ever had a crush on anyone at the studio? <laughs> <laughs> And who? <laughs> yes. And what? And who? Yeah. No. Do I, no. Have you though? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ooh, no, he's like had no. A crush. No, yeah, like as you do. Yeah. When he was oh. first fresh, when he was, was so cute. Oh. His little long hair. <laughs> now what am I? <laughs> you're still cute, yeah. but now you're like scary. Uh, what, oh. Am I? Give <laughs> 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 a macho. Oh. <laughs> and he always does the sort of love heart on his headshots. Yes. Oh, yeah. case. Cuddles with Casey. Cuddles with Casey, yeah. That's what I that's what I want for my new <laughs> Dancer Scott and Cuddles with Casey. Oh, Everything's oh, coming in Cuddles case. Fun. Yeah. Hi <laughs> <laughs> okay. oh, no. I love it. Okay, he's had a crush. Cute. Oh, yeah, that's cute. But we don't We're know here who. For it. We don't get to find out. Oh, I feel like That's for another episode. That's okay, another great. Episode. Tune in, guys. Tune in. Cute. Alex. Yes. Dairy or gluten? Oh, dairy. If I would, oh, if really? I could, I would choose dairy, yeah. Oh no. No? I couldn't. Really? I would poo for days. <laughs> no, I, I mean, I wouldn't poo, but I just get really bored with both. So oh, if I could choose, I'm... I would go dairy. Okay. Cheese, respect. ice cream, all that fun stuff. Do you still eat it? Oh, totally. Okay. Yeah. Just in when moderation. I'm not working, because yeah. you don't want to think I'm pregnant when I yeah, come into work. <laughs> uh, sticking with Alex again, because we yeah. know you're a bit of a keen cyclist of late. Oh, cool. Would you rather... <laughs> She's in training, Am I? <laughs> <laughs> would you rather teach cycle or never be able to do a burpee again? Oh. oh. 
And you know it's bad because, like, the pause is very long. Mm. I don't know. Teach sky- cycle. I think you just have to. I just yeah. have to because like I can't not therapy. Or- yeah. Or once a month. Yeah. <laughs> Team teach. Team teach with, with you and then you yeah. can take all of it and I'll take the last round. Community, community <laughs> ride with yeah. Alex. <laughs> I like that Oh, question. that's a good one. It's brutal. Um, now, Casey, we're going to throw to you. Um, you do have the option. So you can either finish your drink oh. or we've got a little snippet of your short film <laughs> that oh. we can we can play as well. Yes. Nah, yeah, give it to the people, yeah. Oh, yes. Yes. what a legend. <laughs> so if you don't know, Casey is a budding actor as well. He's I'm still going to drink my drink, but... Yeah, yeah respect. <laughs> we love that. So he does have a bit of a film career behind him. So Scott, we... what did you do recently? The little filming thing. Oh, yeah, no, it was just a, co- a little commercial. Oh. Um, it was just like a video. Uh, Is it going like, to be on, like, Channel 7? No, it was just for, <laughs> it was for like, the company. Oh, cool. Not, yeah, they're yeah. not going to, like, oh, send okay. it out. But yeah. they're going to keep it there, which is, mm. which is good. So good. Yeah. So, yeah, Case has done a few short films. He's done... <laughs> Are we getting to watch this? Yeah. Are we watching it? I reckon we can watch it, yeah. yeah. I yeah. think so. Yeah, yeah let's okay. chuck it on. We'll chuck yeah. it on, yeah. You? There's the little case. Oh. There he is. Robin's yes. No destiny. What do you mean no destiny? You're not completely mad. Oh, sir. That's my mate. <laughs> Did you hit him? <laughs> <laughs> so I good, Kate. I love you. It's You're just, the best. Uh, well we done. love to see it. <laughs> we love yeah. to see like, it. That was like two years ago. Yeah, you You're look like so a baby. Little. You look like a baby. The hair. Mm-hmm. And the yeah. face. It just looks younger. Just, yeah, little bob. And he's all... <laughs> you've got your muscles now. Oh. You've bulked up. Oh, sorry. <laughs> he's doing the shred. Shred. Yeah, ma- yeah macro mic. Oh. oh. Good protein, eh? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah okay. Secret plug. We're not, we're not sponsored by macro <laughs> mic. <laughs> macro <laughs> mic, guys. <laughs> oh, and cool. In terms of your acting, dream role, Casey. What is it? Yeah. What's the- um, like a, a role. If you could be uh, in any movie, film, franchise, dream role. Honestly, like, uh, like Marvel way. Eh? Like, yeah. I was picturing myself as like, you know, like Tony Stark, and I was just like, I was like, I'm in the cinema, and I was like, wow. they're big. You know, even even um like like um, um Suicide Squad. I watched that number two like oh, ages ago. Um, but you know, just watching like those actors, you know, like because they brought in a fair few actors for that, mm. and just watching. Oh, like, they're oh. massive. Yeah, it's yeah. massive, and was, you get so many movies out of it too. Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was just like looking at those actors, like very wow. cool. You know, just very action. I like the action. Yeah, love that. you know, I love to like. You can you tell know, like, from that short film. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the adventure. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the adventure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I good. Loves the action. Yeah, yeah. Um, Alex, Coda or Will? Coda. <laughs> <laughs> That, well, I do not oh, even have to think about that. We love Coda. <laughs> we love oh, Coda. I love Will. We I love Will. Will. <laughs> sure, but Coda. Will's a legend. For context, Coda is the dog. The dog. And, and Will's Will her boyfriend. boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, Case, you or Jonty, who's a better dancer? Oh, Jonty. He makes up all the dance moves, oh, honestly. I'm he's like, a yeah, yeah, he's, he's like, oh. he's like, we should do this and that. And I'm just like, all right, all right. So, like, I... You know, tag along with Johnny, so he actually makes it up. So good on him. You know, so you need Johnny, to Johnny is a dancer. On Instagram because we post oh, them every yeah. week, so. every, every Friday, Friday night. Every Friday night. Friday night, yeah. guys. <laughs> He's not here tonight, but you know, so oh, I can't feel oh, it. You know. Miss you. Yeah. Love you, Johnny. Yeah, love you, Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> and final quick fire question for both of you: oh. favorite receptionist. Me. Favorite. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can say that, so I'm staying with that. I don't know if I can answer this. You have to. Yeah, you have to. Sorry. Question. Yeah. Oh. Oh. DJ Hammy. DJ Hammy. Yeah, I knew it. Like, no, of like, course. I love, like, the whole reception team. DJ Hammy. Yeah. Love He's that. your boy. Yeah, yeah. DJ Hambo. I walk, I, yeah, I walk past Hambo. him and I give him, like, a little slap on the neck. Just like, it's a love Oh, tag. I was going to slap him the ass. <laughs> 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 I'm like, oh, okay, yeah. cute. <laughs> no, Everybody has a crush on yeah. Hamish. Everyone has a crush on Hamish. Yeah, yeah. He's just amazing. He's, yeah, he's amazing. He's like a, Isn't he? Yeah, he's like yeah a you cuddly, do love him. Yeah, you know. <laughs> we'll allow it. Both of you guys. Together. Can we do a shot, like a quick fire shot one back to you guys? Oh. If you want. Oh, okay. I know. I'm going to put it to Casey first because I want to think of one. Go, Case. <laughs> All right, Scott, Grace, have you guys had a crush of anyone in this in the studio? <laughs> huh? Yes. Oh my gosh, no. I mean, not many uh, straight guys come in. Yeah, I know. So. Yeah. yeah. But when they do, no. Really, Scott? No. no. I'm there to do a job. I'm there to inspire. I'm there to. <laughs> He's professional. He is. Yeah. yeah. You've yeah, got to be there. Blur those lines. Well, that's exactly well, the I same take, for Casey. So I'll take back my. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I take back my uh, layers. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's already out of the bag. You can't <laughs> All right, back to you guys. Rumble or cycle? Oh. I, I think we're doing a rumble a episode, so. I'm a bit, um, what's the word? I don't know. I love the rumble at the moment. Yeah. It's just a vibe. Yeah, yeah 100%. And it's been so much fun, obvi. Yeah. But I've been doing it for like two years, so. Yeah. Rumble's it's just, just mixing a nice it up. Change. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. So much fun. So yeah, I think I. I mean, obviously, I moved here as a spin instructor. Yeah. And it's always good. I never saw myself in the rumble room. It was yeah. never something that yeah. I planned on doing. Mm. Um, and I think I got into it. I messaged. How did you get it? I think we were yeah, a bit I desperate messaged, for instructors. I think we had a few, instru- yeah. a few instructors leave after COVID. I mean, we love you, Scotty, but yeah. I think we were a bit desperate. Yeah, it was, it was, there was some barrel scraping that went on, and yeah. here you I am. They asked everybody on the list, <laughs> yeah. and then When you Scott. get to the bottom of the barrel, it's just me and a pair of boxing gloves down there. <laughs> um, so it wasn't something that I set out or planned to do. Yeah. It wasn't something I ever really saw myself doing in there. Yeah. But same thing. I got in there, I was like, this so is good. amazing in here. This is such a good vibe. Yeah. Um, it's, so it's such a different way to sort of motivate and coach people off the bike. Yeah. Um, so it's been a nice challenge there as well. Yeah. 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 Something um, different like you've never done before. Yeah. Until those meals days. In terms yes. of just straight up numbers though, I teach more cycle than I teach mm. rumble. Yeah. Yeah. So That's a good answer. Yes. Nice. Well, yeah. As diplomatic oh, as I can you. be there. <laughs> um, so we do a little thing, high bar, low bar, and it's the best and worst moments that you've had in the studio. Oh. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, I'll start. Yeah. Worst was that vomiting incident. We oh, just, yeah. We, we spoke about that. on another episode. Oh. oh. And didn't Will sit in that yes, afterwards? No, that was the <laughs> best, actually. So Will came in the next day to do his class in the morning, <laughs> and it was the night before. <laughs> And the poor bugger, he was on the bag, and I didn't actually tell him because I thought, nah, it's all good. Like, it'll be dry. And then I made the door wall sit, and he just goes, zoom, feet go out from underneath no. him straight and on. And just straight through the cleaning products. Oh, Amazing. Straight on to it. Hilarious. Oh, poor Will. Yeah. Just I mean, it was all clean, sitting in detergent. But he was I love literally, it. Literally, yeah. It was the funniest thing ever. Um, hi, Lucky moments. it was Will. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lucky. <laughs> no one would have known. It literally was water. So, yeah. like, whatever. And then high moments are definitely, I don't know. I don't have a high. Like, every time I go in there, it just seems to get better and better. I always have so much fun whenever I'm in that rumble room. And then obviously every time we do something, but as like a team, mm-hmm. I just yeah. love it. Mm-hmm. That's just Good like team. the highs of the highs. Yeah. Case? Um, worst, oh, worst moment was when I was like holding as like a plank. And um, so I like, I fired it. And then... <laughs> Was your crush in there? I was not nah. expecting this. <laughs> no, nah, but and then the ring just stunk. Oh. I, was like, I, was like, I was like holding the plate. I was like, keep holding it. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know what to do. I was like. I was like <laughs> nice. That is so good. Oh. Yeah, and like, you would have been so nervous. Oh, my oh, God. I was like, I Imagine was looking around. Imagine it was around. only like two people in the class. But, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But you never, no. Like, no, it was you. <laughs> <laughs> did you. Did you do that? Yeah, it was you. <laughs> no, but there was like, there was, it's funny because there was like, there was like, uh, like eight or something, eight or nine. Oh. And I was like, oh, thank yeah. God. Because like, you know, you never know who it was. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Until they come near you. <laughs> yeah. But now that's out, that's out there, you know that any time that happens in class, we're oh, all eyes are yeah. on you moving guys, forward. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, look, guys. Look, look, yeah. Yeah. It actually happened the other day. I, like, I, 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 no, I don't. <laughs> we don't need to know about your fart. <laughs> no, I, I mean, fart. It was someone now else. Every like, time it comes into the class and it smells its case. Oh, honestly, guys, I was like, this is this is disgusting. Um, <laughs> but <laughs> my my. Um, oh, that's the best case. My highs. Oh my! Oh my! Musical madness. I like when that when that was on. I just get like the most like the biggest buzz, eh? Yeah. But when you did Queen and oh. it was no, when you did Women <laughs> International Women's Day or something. Guys, get, yeah. look at this. Here's the story. <laughs> he did Queen and he's like, "Are you the Queen's a woman?" No. <laughs> I was like, "No." I knew it was Freddie no. Mercury, but yeah. I was like, "What, what, what was your woman? reasoning for this? Do you remember?" Um, yeah. So International Women's Day. So I thought yeah. women love like nice woman, like womanly music. Yeah. You know, yeah. and then oh, so but that was, I that was what totally your process like was. yeah yeah that was my was thought it? process. I was like, oh, I'm gonna chuck him with Queen, you yeah. know. But I didn't. Re- I realize it now that it was meant so to be good. a full. We love Queen though. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, but Holly didn't. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she just 
hilarious. Yeah, yeah. Holly we all yeah. loved it. Love theme rides. And you guys have been team teaching, team teaching a bit lately <laughs> yeah. as well. Team teaching. Yeah, we have been. The hour, the empower hour. We love it. Yeah, it's fresh and so much. The rubber room. Yeah, yeah. And it's good too because it's like, it's like. Um, like we get six rounds, six rounds each. Yeah. So it's like, you know, we get, like, I get the break and do the workout too. You know, like yeah. watching Alex do a thing, and I was like, heck yeah. And then it comes to me, so it's like different energies. You know, it's like you get Alex, yeah. you get Casey, you get Alex, you get Casey. Very and we're cool. so yeah. different in the way we like all yeah. of us are. All the instructors are so different, so mm. it's really, really good. I think when we do do team teachers, because people are like, oh cool, oh, yeah. Like, yeah, this is what that person's and like. They may know? not have done your class no. before, so then they know what you're like exactly yeah, yeah exactly. it's a good idea yeah, yeah. Like, yeah i saw a girl in in, in your class uh, in our team teacher i yeah. hadn't seen before yeah and then you know and then she comes along to the next to, to my next class yeah, yeah. Like, oh, you know? i think it's, it's so important to yeah. do that kind of stuff because yeah. it's nice to try all the instructors yes you're going to have like people that you're like, yeah I, I really like that going yeah. to those classes but yeah. i think it's so important to still be able to try everyone and be like oh yeah because everyone's amazing yeah, every instructor yeah. you try cycle box yeah. both incredible i think yeah. you've got to give them a little go totally cuties how we like to finish each mm-hmm. episode off is a little bit of a flashback and a little bit of a advice to your younger self. Oh, cute. Mm. So Aww. if you could give advice to young Casey and young Alex here, Casey. what would you say? Oh, Casey little looks frog. so cute. Yeah. <laughs> Alex, what would you say to little Alex there? I like, I get emotional little Alexandra. looking at that and I don't know Alexandra. why. Little Alexandra. <laughs> I think I just get emotional because she was still like that was my first day of prep and I remember like starting prep and loving prep and then we moved in like grade one because my fam wanted to uh, for whatever reason and then we moved to a totally different school and it's just it's so crazy because it's just like change is going to happen throughout life and I think that at that point in my life I had no idea of change like everything had been the same and I think it's just important to know that like change is okay and it's going to be okay so Mm. I think I'd say that to myself to be honest it's always going to be okay. Yeah, yeah that, as much as like change is inevitable. It's inevitable, yeah. And I think it's the way you sort of Adapt deal with that change exactly. and adapt to change. I think it's like a being aware that it's going to happen in your life and it's okay. Because I think if you always think things are going to be comfortable. That's one thing I always say in the rumble room. It's like get used to being uncomfortable because like that's where things change and that's where it's mm. good, you know. Where like, you grow. Where you grow, yeah. Yeah, and, and change is not necessarily a bad thing. It's, I Definitely think not. People sort of fall into that trap of yeah, hearing comfy. the word change yeah. and associating it with a bad thing. So like, think, hence the move up here. I was so comfortable in Melbourne, like mm-hmm. too comfortable. Life was amazing to the point where it was like, this is just That's easy, good. you yeah. know? And I was like, okay, it's time. And yeah. I think it's good like to be able to change and actually yeah. feel comfortable with that. So I'd be like saying, be comfortable, babe. It's going to be okay. So good. So Love good. that. <clears throat> um, yeah, I just tell myself, you know, that everything like happens for reasons, you know, pretty much. Because it's like, I wouldn't be here without like, you know, like getting like, going after job, 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 you know? So like, yeah, because I was doing my acting, you know, I was like, I was like going to like auditions and that, and like this one was even an audition, you know? So, yep. but keep going and like getting turned down a lot. And then you'll get that one, like, you know, yeah. The you know, progress, like, yeah, the yeah, banger. Yeah, yeah, you know, the banger, yeah. and this is the banger. So this like inspires something to change my life. Yeah. So it's like, you know, you know, looking back at myself, I would say, just keep going, you know, things happen for reasons, you know, whatever happens, happens, you yeah. know, just move on, don't look back, move on, you know. So, so good. Yeah. I love yeah. that. You're such a cutie. I you both are. Yeah. You both. I think, yeah. It's so cute seeing everybody's little face. It is, hey. I like the little sassy hand on the hip. Yeah, that's yeah. Yeah. Like the pose. Take a photo at your first day of school. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously okay. very shy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, clearly. No. <laughs> good so old good. prep. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Nice, no, guys. Thank, thank you. you so much thank for coming you. in. It's been great to sort of get a bit more info about yeah, the bon- totally. Rumble Room and mm. a bit more background on both of you. It's been yeah. really cool. Thanks yeah. so much yeah. for having yeah. us. No, thank you. Yeah. We love you guys. It was great. Love you. Love you. Bye. Thank you, Grace, Thanks, again Scotty. for joining me as always. It's been a pleasure. So exciting. Another ep down. Another ep down. Check cool. him off. Check it in the can. <laughs> as always, guys, rate, review, subscribe, all that sort of good stuff. Um, jump into the show notes. Offbeat 10 gives you a yeah. sneaky little discount code for some packs so you can chuck the podcast down and jump into the studio and come and see us. us In real life. Yeah, IRL. IRL. Love Love that. (laughs) (laughs) All right, guys. Bye. 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 Bye.